We are the sixth best state agriculture university in the country out of 74 universities. We have been also ranked as a band excellent category of a university by the Ministry of Education Government of India. And this university is an A grade accredited university in the country. We have created an ecosystem of you know, outcome based education in this university. We have developed some 92 varieties of crops. We are also working on the vaccine development. We are the first university who have been able to clone the Pashmina first time in the world. At the same time, we have introduced a policy, the innovation and startup policy in the university. And the outcome of that policy is that some six students have already established their companies as the private limited companies. Same is the case with the faculty. Many faculty members are now taking their innovations to the startups. So a couple of faculty startups are also you know, happening in this university. Uh, and this has given us you know, uh, the confidence that from here on, you know, we would admit the students nationally and internationally. Uh, because in this university, we are offering seven undergraduate programs, uh, 60 postgraduate programs, and equal number of the uh, short skill training programs in this university. So with this, we are opening our university for admission of the international students. And I'm very confident that the infrastructure which we have in this university and the able faculty in this university and the way we are integrating our education with the national education policy you know, should provide a very good ecosystem and environment for the national and the international students in this university. If you will take the horticulture sector of Jammu and Kashmir, horticulture sector contributes 15,000 crores to the economy of JNK. And with the introduction of high density orcharding system, it will surge to 30,000 crore. At the Faculty of Horticulture, we undergo UG, PhD and PG courses with the help of 12 subject matter divisions. And our main thrust is on fruit science, vegetable science, floriculture and landscape architecture, post harvest management. I welcome and extend my good wishes to the all aspirants who wish to pursue their degree programs at the Faculty of Horticulture. As a student of the Faculty of Horticulture, you get access to well-equipped library and resource system. The university has subscription with national and international journals, periodicals and research journals. The university is having state-of-art facility with computer labs where students can work 24-7. Following the new vision of Education Policy 2020, the students can choose any degree from our well-tailored skill and degree-oriented courses which include undergraduate programs, postgraduate programs and doctorate programs. The kind of a startup culture that university is providing to its students has inspired me enough to be the founder of one of the first kind of startups from this campus. I have been the proud student of this university and uh, now a proud incubity. We have developed more than 100 success stories in the field of farming where our high density planting, vermicomposting, floriculture and vegetable farming practices have been successfully demonstrated on farmers' field. It has doubled the income of farmers and fulfilled the vision of doubling the income by 2025. Novelty is always around the corner in our university which is released in the form of patents. 13 patents have been received so far. We conduct trainings for farmers, entrepreneurs, policy planners for their skill enhancement from time to time. The diverse working environment and the new innovative research and technology on different aspects like genomics, cell culture, honey extraction, fruit breeding, plant pathogens help us in getting desired results comprehensively covering all the aspects. I welcome all the students who will be coming to this university. I am very hopeful that they will find it a very good experience while they are at this university.